Hello sports fans, welcome to Super Sports Central. Today, we're going to be going over my USFL Championship Game prediction. So the USFL Championship Game will be played uh, Saturday, July 1st in Canton, Ohio between the defending USFL champions and the South Division champions, the Birmingham Stallions, and the North Division champion, the Pittsburgh Maulers. So briefly going over how each team got to the USFL Championship Game, the Stallions, they were the best team throughout the entire season. They finished the season at 8-2. They've won six straight games and are coming off an absolutely dominant 47-22 win over the Breakers in the uh, South Division Championship game. Uh, plus, the Stallions won the USFL Championship last season and have been the undisputed best team since the league returned a year ago. For the Mowers, they've taken a much different path. They were a league worst 1-9 last season. They brought in a ton of new phases to start this season, including new, new quarterbacks, multiple new quarterbacks, new head coach, and built a tremendous defense, which has led them to this point. And the Mowers, they're a perfect example of team peaking at the right time because... They went only 4-6 and six in the regular season, and they're 5-6 and six after including last week's win over the Panthers. But their winners were 3 straight on their offense, which has been a weakness all, all season long, has been playing better in their few, past few games. So going over the key to the game for each team. So the key to the game for the Pittsburgh Mowers is slow down USFL MVP Alex Magoo. Magoo is a huge reason the Stallions are here in the USFL Championship game, and if the Mowers can use their league best defense, to stop, and the Mowers will greatly improve their chances of winning the USFL Championship. Now, when these two teams faced off in Week 4, Alex Magoo had his worst game of the season with just 205 total yards, two, two total touchdowns, and also two turnovers, and he did not turn the ball over much at all this season. So the Mowers, they're going to need to keep Alex Magoo uh, under constant pressure inside the pocket and not let him get out outside the pocket and make all the insane plays we're used to him making. The key to the game for the Stallions is pretty straightforward. It's to outscore the Mowers. So it seems obvious because in football, obviously you need to score more points than your opponent. But when I say outscore the Mowers, I mean get a lot of points up on the board early so the Mowers can't come back. Because the Mowers offense isn't great. So if they face a decent-sized deficit early, I think it's going to be pretty hard for them to come back against a decent Stallion defense. Now, the Stallions offense is coming off a 47-point outburst. So if they can have another good performance offensively, uh, they will definitely get the win. Now, it might not be as easy as you might think for the Stallions because the Stallions, they have the best offense in the USFL, but they face the Mowers, the team with the best defense in the USFL. So the Mowers, they are definitely the team that could slow down the Stallions' offense because the Mowers' defense is superstars on all three levels. Now, while the Mowers are the team that could stop the Stallions, the Stallions are also the team that could drop 35-plus points on the Mowers and their elite defense. So it's definitely a very interesting matchup between the Stallions' offense and the Mowers defense, and the team who wins that matchup is most likely going to end up winning the championship, and that matchup will likely determine the outcome of the game. So my prediction for the game, I could definitely see this game going either way. Now, even though the Stallions are probably the better team, they're definitely the better team on paper, it matches up fairly well for the Mowers, so that's why I could see this going either way, because their defense has been so good. It's strength versus strength, weakness versus weakness, so uh, it's really not a terrible matchup for the Mowers, but... I've got the Birmingham Stallions getting the win and winning the USFL Championship. Once again, winning their second straight USFL Championship and second in franchise history. I have them defeating the Pittsburgh Mowers by a score of 31-24, with uh, uh, Alex Magoo being the MVP. So we will also have a live watch party for the USFL Championship game. That will start a few minutes before 8 p.m. Eastern Time on Saturday. So make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so as that. And I hope to see you guys there. But uh, that is my USFL Championship Game prediction. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, turn on notifications to see almost any of the upcoming videos or our a live watch party for the USFL Championship Game. Make sure to check out the community tab on my channel where you can vote on who you think won the USFL Championship. But thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, turn on notifications. Let me know in the comments who you have winning the USFL Championship Game, what your score is, and who's going to win MVP. But I do my best puts as often as possible, and I will see you in the next video.